Welcome to ITU Telecom World 2018 here in Durban, South Africa, where I'm very pleased to be joining the studio today, Mr. Invida Lamini, who is from the uh, Eswatini Communications Commission. He's actually the chief executive, and we're very pleased to have you in the studio today. It's my pleasure to be here this morning. Now, I'd like to start off by talking a little bit about uh, smart digital development. That's the uh, theme here at ITU Telecom World. What does that mean to you, and what does that mean to Eswatini? For us, it means the future. Um, I think for countries like Swaziland, uh, or rather Eswatini, and, uh, and, and a lot of developing countries, you know, smart digital uh, development is, is key in uh, actually growing our economies, uh, making sure that you know, we don't get left behind in the fourth industrial revolution. And in terms of innovation, there's a lot of innovation going on here. We've got lots of SMEs, we've got lots of, uh, of uh, interesting uh, projects and products being, uh, being shown here and showcased here. What single innovation do you think is going to make the most difference to Eswatini? Well, I think for the whole world, 5G is just going to transform our world uh, in ways never seen before, uh, you know, uh, with smart cities and smart cars and the like. It's, it's certainly going to change our lives. Um, it's a few years away, but uh, certainly we're looking forward to it. And uh, in terms of digital entrepreneurship, what uh, are the key objectives for Swatini's uh, in driving uh, digital entrepreneurship? In fact, we have got what we call the Royal uh, Technology Park in Swaziland, which the King um, started a couple of years ago. Uh, it's now operational. It's got an incubation uh, center for, for, for startups. Um, and uh, we, we, as uh, the regulator, in fact, we have a, to play a huge role in the development of ICTs in the country in general. So we are very supportive of that. Uh, we, we just lack, at the moment, maybe the skills necessary to to get uh, to the top but certainly with uh, collaboration and partners that we meet here at, at, at uh, ITU uh, Telecom 2018 certainly uh, you know the sky is the limit we certainly hope to reap those benefits I was going to say what are the, the major challenges and perhaps also the the, uh, the, the great opportunities yeah, the, the uh, we only see opportunities um, Challenges, they're always there, but uh, you know, you, it actually just makes you think uh, more on how you can overcome them. You know, it's, it's, there's plenty of opportunities. Uh, there's also plenty uh, with the SMEs that are here. There's so many solutions that are available that uh, we can use as a country, as a regulator, and even for the operators. So certainly the sky's the limit. Uh, and, and I mean, this is a premier event for us. To, to learn as much as possible. We are a young country and um, a young regulator, but uh, we, we, we are learning from the best just by attending such events. That's great. What's been the, the highlight for you from your attendance here? It's, 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 it's just the sheer volume of information that you, you receive in this place. Uh, and there's just not enough uh, hours in the day to, to take advantage, you know. You, You've got site meetings with you know everyone, for, you know our operators, our potential suppliers, you know potential partners, other regulators. There's, there's just so much. And of obviously the plenary sessions, and uh, you know there was also the Smart Connect just uh, next door. You know all relevant information for us. So. Um, Perhaps if this event was two weeks, that would have been ideal. If somebody compared it to <laughs> shrinking the globe, really. For, you, know, you can literally walk uh, two paces and you'll be in one country and then in another. And so it's a lot easier to, to communicate and, and to exchange information and ideas. Certainly, uh, certainly. I mean, the digital world has just made the, the whole world one. Uh, you know, you, you don't need to go to a country to, 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 to talk to someone, you know. The technologies are there, you know. It's just to make sure we've got the available bandwidth and everything else. Uh, obviously, most of us developing countries, we're still complaining about the prices of data. You know, if we can sort that out, uh, suddenly the world is just uh, one small globe. You know. In terms of... Uh the participants here in terms of a message uh, uh, that you might be might want to deliver might be able to share with us what, what would that be no it's really collaboration um, you know those that um, 
have, have run the mile, you know, offer all the assistance you can to, uh, to, to, to those of us that need it. Um, and, you know, we can all have a, you know, the, make a better place to live in, you know. Uh, what's the use of you being so far ahead when somebody else is struck, still struggling, you know, uh, some of us developing countries. I mean, uh, I think the, the, the developed countries, there's a lot that can, they, they can do to help us, you know, bridge that digital uh, divide. Well, wish you the very best for the future and thank you very much for joining us in the studio today. It's my pleasure. Thank you. Thank you.